Welcome to Condoning Drones. Let's get started. Before doing a Master Shots, which is an intelligent flight mode, position your drone so that its altitude is above everything else nearby. Make sure to quit recording to enter Master Shots. Tap on the film strip icon and then select Master Shots. Based on the subject and distance, the aircraft will automatically shoot a number of clips and create a master shot. Draw a rectangle around your subject and the estimated flight time bar appears. The master shot will take two minutes unless you change settings. Let's do so and change the width, length, and height to small. We tap the green start button and notice we are warned to watch out for surrounding obstacles. If you need to abort the master shot's flight, simply raise your altitude or stop by tapping the red X. A few days earlier, I tested master shots for the first time. Notice I was recording at 1080p 30. As you can see, I was in a wide open area. I tried tapping on film strip icon to choose master shots, but I had to stop recording in order to open master shots. The very first time you try master shots, the tutorial is quite different than later tries, like the hand here. Also entering master shots changed the resolution from 1080p 30 to 4K 30. I got in position and finally highlighted my subject. Notice instructions only seen on the very first master shots. Happy with medium settings, I tapped the green start button and countdown began. Watch the drone icon on the map move to the left as distance increases. The Air 3 was heading toward trees that were off camera, so I raised the altitude and the master shots aborted. Note that the Air 3's height at the start is 120 feet. The first shot is a droney. Next, it does a far circle. Notice the white segments. Each segment represents which shot is being executed. Now, pitch up and fly forward. I'll let you read the upcoming shots. Recall the original height at the beginning was 120 feet. It now returns to 125 feet. Also, since I was screen recording with the RC2, I am unable to view the Master Shots video which was created.
So where is the master shot video saved? Remove the SD card from the Air 3 and open it in the PC. Open DCIM folder, and in my case, I'll open the DJI 001 folder. Find the files created. Mine were made on November 7th. The first MP4 was the regular drone footage that I stopped before starting master shots. This is the master shot created and it is around two minutes or so. This time I decided to try medium width, length, and height. Here's something you might not know. I was at an altitude of 210 feet. I checked the settings to be sure that the default of medium was selected, and it was. I tapped the green start button and got this warning. Basically my starting height was too high and the master shot would reach the limit of 400 feet because of my settings. So I tried again. This is the 4K master shot with the kind of shots from the screen capture overlaid.
Here are the list of master shots, which were the same for the small and the medium flights. Droney, circle, far, pitch up and fly forward, circle, close, circle, medium, rocket, camera down and fly forward, camera down and circle, camera straight and descend, and camera down and descend. During this master shots flight, the height began at 174 feet during Droney. During Circle Far, the Air 3 reached 274 feet. The highest was 370 feet during Camera Down and Circle. Keep in mind, on small master shots flight, expect your drone to ascend 150 feet above your starting height. And on medium master shots, expect your drone to ascend 200 feet above your starting height. So is it safe to assume, on large master shots flight, should you expect your drone to ascend 250 feet above your starting height? Recall when I got this warning earlier. It was because my starting height was 210 feet and on medium master shots expect Air 3 to ascend 200 feet higher than the starting height. So it would have reached an altitude of 410 feet or so, which is above the limit I set in my settings. Let's try a master shots with large width, large length, and large height. My starting height is 124 feet. After changing to large, I tap the green start button and I get no error messages this time. So that means that when the Air 3 ascends, it will not go higher than the maximum altitude limit that I've already set. One thing we haven't checked out yet is the map of the master shot course created. Let's do so now. You might have noticed that the large master shots has some additional shots not found in the small and medium master shots like roll and fly forward. Let me point out that the highest height during the large master shots was 360 feet and the starting height was 124 feet, a difference of 236 feet or close to the 250 feet that we expected. I hope I have given you good advice. Make sure that you have plenty of area to execute your master shots flight. Choose small, medium or large depending on your location. Don't set your initial height too high or you may be instructed to change settings. Be well and see you next time on Condoning Drones.